the first time uh, the San Francisco bands ever got together and, and drove out into the country, you know, like in the old days, like going on the road, Quicksilver and Grateful Dead, uh, the, we called it the Great Northwest Tour in 1968. And we went, came up through uh, Oregon and, uh, and went on to Seattle, if I'm not mistaken. It was just the biggest hoot because we were driving, we just drove up in cars and, and, and my truck followed with our equipment. And San Francisco bands really enjoyed a lot of camaraderie. There was never a lot, of, uh, any competition really, but among us in the commercial world, you know, we would hang out just an awful lot, and it, they, everybody was good friends, and we just we had a great time. We played some incredible music, some of which might have even made it onto a Grateful Dead album. I'm, I'm not really sure. <laughs> We always felt at that time we were on the cutting edge of human consciousness moving forward in the, in the spiritual world, and uh, and so each each event like that was like a, another exploration, and we just wanted to make the most of it as often as possible. And, and we, we didn't we didn't even think that there was going to be a peak. We just knew that where we were was the most exciting place in the world. In, or in, in the universe to be at that moment. No one had a thought for any kind of historical significance or consequences or, or what does this all mean for society in general. Yeah. Nobody cared. <laughs>